Yeah, that's right, Drew Lauren. This is nearly a year-long program that helps kids in the community create their own business. The CEO and founder, who lost a son to gun violence, says she's working to get kids invested in their future before it's too late. With newly earned certificates in hand and smiles on their faces. Hey, President. On Sunday, the 2022 graduating class of Louisville's ACE Project got what they've been working for for the past seven months, the tools needed to launch their own business. When I first started my business, it was really rough. 16-year-old Denasia Jefferson will be the first to say this was not a simple process. It looked easy, but then when I'm going into it actually and doing my product, I realized it wasn't so easy. But through hard work, she was able to create Ruffles, a clothing accessory business that gives her customers a unique look. And Rose Smith, the CEO and founder of Ace Project, says it's also giving Jefferson new hope. Denasia lost her dad to gun violence, and she found an outlet. Smith started the program in honor of Corey Crow, her 24-year-old son who was killed in 2014. The program is mostly made up of kids who've been personally impacted by gun violence. It's giving them hope, and that's what our community and our city and our world is lacking, is hope. And hope is something Smith believes kids in Louisville need now more than ever. The biggest thing I learned is that you should never give up. The graduation now means the students' products are officially launched and on the market. But some of the young entrepreneurs say this is only the beginning. I'm going to stay in the entrepreneurship program for two more years. It gives me something productive to do and also something that I like to do at the same time. And the program has grown from 17 kids in the first year to now 21 total in the second year. But Smith says this is just the start. Her goal is to have 50 kids in the program by next year. Live in the newsroom, I'm Anash Gungwari. Drew.